the coronavirus epidemic is a thing. However, the logical, illogical form whereby a, a theory, there's a theory about X, X is a conspiracy, therefore not X, is not, not a thing. I keep hearing, uh, I keep reading stories where it seem to imply that if a theory is about a conspiracy, then that theory must be false. Um, that is that is absurd. It's also it is also absurd to claim that if a uh, to compl- say if it's take a conspiracy that is happening, actually a true conspiracy, then somebody theorizes about that. Does that theorizing in itself make the conspiracy false? Of course not. To believe that such a thing would be absurd. Do conspiracies happen? Yes. They happen all the time. From the beginning of history, there has been conspiracies going on. Since we've had to have uh, have had history. Um, so what is a conspiracy? I like to go, like, rather than just turn the dictionary, I like to think about it in mind. Well, what, what, what do I have in mind? What is a conspiracy? Um, I would just say it is a secret plot of some sort. That's what I have in mind when I think of a conspiracy. Now, so have secret plots ever occurred in the history of, of humanity? I think so. Yes. So, and have there ever been theories about those conspiracies that did happen, that are true. Yes. I'm sure there has been. Actually, I think that's about the only way that we can, if we're not involved in the conspiracy itself, that's about the only way that we can have any belief about conspiracy is through theorizing. Because there, if, if there, for there to be a plot, that implies a an intent in the minds of the plotters. But since we cannot read minds, there's no way to empirically verify for anybody that's observing on the outside of the plot, of the conspiracy, there's no other way to conclude that a conspiracy has happened other than to theorize about it. Therefore, that's the theory uh, conspiracy conspiracy theories happen all the time. Anytime we anybody has a belief about a secret plot, that person is engaging in a conspiracy theory. Now, I can see some from all sorts of all sorts of directions, all across the political spectrum. People engage in, in uh, theorizing about possibility of conspiracies occurring. Um, so, but, so you know, but then we wonder why is there such a um, why does the mainstream media want seem to want to put a pall over the act of engaging in theorizing about conspiracies? Could it be that uh, the powers that be are themselves engaging in a conspiracy and they don't want to be found out and the only way that they can be found out is by if people speculate on what they're they're uh, they're going about, oh, how, what they're what they're what the goings on are behind the scenes, what what secret plots may they have, and if people keep thinking about that and talking about their ideas about what's going on by the ruling elite, what 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 are they doing? Eventually, the, the masses, people on the outside, will come across. So finally. Um, the conclusion, a true conclusion about what, what uh, the, the secret plotters are doing in the highest echelons of power. And those people in the power, they don't want to be found out. So they need to uh, put a, a cast a uh, um, dispersions on the very act of speculating about what the powers that be are doing so that they'll, they won't to avoid, um, to discourage people on the outside, the masses, 
from engaging in that kind of speculation. It's because the less speculating that will be happening, the less likely the powers that be will be will be discovered about what they're what they're conspiring what kind of conspiracies they're, they're engaged in. So, um, but I think, so there, therefore, as a result, I think it's a good, good thing to engage, engage in uh, conspiracy theories. So to keep, to keep the powers that be accountable. Um, and, and don't uh, be discouraged from engaging in any kind of conspiracy theory uh, because of the negative association that the mainstream media, the corporate-run media, who are directly connected with the ruling elite powers that be, because those uh, those, those mainstream corporate media, um, don't be discouraged by them, because they seem to be obviously trying to discourage you from think, to, uh, discussing, contemplating, thinking about what they may be up to. And the only way you're going to find out what they're up to and uh, hold them to account is by engaging in conspiracy theories. So I'm saying keep it up. Good work. That's all I have to say for now. I'm not taking any sides one way or the other about any particular conspiracy theory. It just, I think it's a good thing. And we need to keep the uh, powers that be held accountable. Keep, keep them in check. It's the best way to avoid corruption in power. That's all I have to say for now. I was going to keep this video short. Thanks for watching. Mm -hmm.